Unveiling the world of Shipper in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we make English easy and fun for everyone. Today, we're diving into a fascinating and popular term in modern English, shipper. Whether you've heard it in conversations, seen it online, or it's completely new to you, this video will clear up all your doubts about what it means and how it's used. So, let's get started. Before we understand what shipper means, let's look at where it comes from. The term shipper is actually short for relationshipper. It originated in fan communities, especially online, where people discuss and root for romantic relationships in movies, TV shows, books, or even real life. A shipper is someone who supports or wishes for a particular relationship, usually a romantic one. Now, let's explore how shipper is commonly used. 1. As a noun. When you say, I am a shipper, it means you support a specific relationship. For example, I am a shipper of Harry and Hermione in the Harry Potter series. 2. In verb form, sometimes, Ship is used as a verb, like, I ship Harry and Hermione. This means you desire or support the idea of them being in a relationship. 3. Beyond fiction, the usage of shipper isn't limited to fictional characters. It can also apply to real-life people, particularly celebrities. To help you understand better, let's see some examples. In a conversation, are you a shipper of Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston? I think they were great together. On social media, hashtag Team Aniston, totally shipping Jen and Brad. Understanding shipper also means being aware of its cultural significance and potential misunderstandings. It's a term deeply rooted in fan culture and is often used lightheartedly. However, be mindful that using this term in serious or formal conversations might be confusing or inappropriate. Finally, it's important to remember that shipper is an example of how language evolves. New words and meanings emerge, especially with the influence of the internet and social media. As English learners, keeping up with these changes can be both challenging and exciting. And that's a wrap on our journey through the world of Shipper. We hope this video has been informative and engaging. Remember, language is always evolving, and keeping up with these changes is part of the fun of learning English. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content. Keep learning and keep smiling. See you in the next video.